All right, guys, so we decided to cook Talkies. some Puerto Rican food this weekend. Uh, the first thing I'm going to start off with is uh, tostones. Those are, these are green plantains. Um, you want to use them green because they have more starch in them. As they get um, more yellow, then they get more uh, sweeter. So they don't have the right consistency for a tostone. So these are not easy to peel like a banana. I usually take it and hold my knife like this so I don't cut too deep. And I make a couple of lines in them. I haven't done this in a while, so. And then I'm usually able to peel it off. not as easy as banana. All right, so now I got all the skin off. I'm gonna cut them into about inch and a half chunks. Something like that. Right around inch and a half-ish. And I have, uh, I have six of these, so I'm gonna uh, do all these and then we'll meet back up for the first set of cooking. All right, so I got my, uh, Six tostones, plant, uh, plantains, or not tostones, I got my six plantains uh, cut up. I got a big Dutch oven heating up here. Come on. I got a tripod, so. Um, so I'm gonna use this uh, avocado oil. I never used this before. It's supposed to be high heat, not have much flavor, so we'll try that out. I'm gonna put a good amount of oil in, maybe three quarter of an inch. So tostones get uh, cooked twice. They get fried twice. Once to soften them, because these are kind of hard, almost like a potato right now, when they're uh, when they're they green like that. Bananas. They're plantains. They look like bananas. They're not quite bananas. Yeah, I was wondering why you. Were... So we're gonna let this oil heat up, and then uh, once it's hot, we'll uh, start frying them off in batches. All right, so the oil heated up. You wanna make sure that the oil starts sizzling when you put something in, like that. So that's hot enough. So tostones, the green plantains, the green platanos get cooked two times. First, we're gonna cook them like this. And we can lower, it doesn't have to get all brown right now. Right now we're trying to cook them through and soften them up. And then we're going to smash them. And then we're going to fry them a second time once smashed. <laughs> so, you can help me smash. You will help me, yeah. I don't want you by the hot oil, honey. All right, so we're gonna let these go for a bit and I'll bring you back when we flip them. And then we'll uh, go from there. All right, so it's been about four minutes or so. They started browning. Oh, where am I? Started browning up a little bit. So I'm just going to flip them and let them go another uh, few minutes. And they should be cooked through. And the next step in this is to then uh, smash them, which we'll, uh, which we'll do next. So... I'll just, uh, I'll turn you back on right when we're uh, about to do the smashing. All right, so this first batch is looking good. I'm gonna take them out. Actually, the oil's a little hot, I'll turn it down. It's almost. Then we're going to do the same thing. We got another uh, another good. batch to do, and then we'll be back. All right. So the next step on the plantains, after they've been cooked once, is we're gonna smash them. Which side did I clean? We're just, I use a can because the can's got like a a little lip in there. It doesn't let you go too far.
cook them like that, smash them, and then we're gonna get these all smashed and we're gonna fry them again. All right, we got the oil smoking hot. These are all crushed. And we're gonna fry these guys until they're nice and brown. This oil being so hot, it's not gonna take long. This, and then we're gonna take them out when they're done onto some paper towel so the oil drains off. And we're gonna immediately hit them with salt. If you wait too long to hit them with salt, the salt won't stick very well. I'll, uh, I'll show you when they come out. All right, so I hope these are done cooking. They look good. You take them out, let them drain. paper towel and then we want to immediately hit them with salt. Yeah. Alright, and that's it. That's Tostones. When they cool off we'll have the kids taste them. All right, so here's the finished tostones, here's the finished uh, breaded meat, and here's the finished rice and beans. So good. Thanks.